Hello everyone, I am Satish Kade, Assistant Professor of AI and DS Department of AISSMS IOIT Pune. Today I am going to explain the unit security in cloud computing of the topic data encryptions in the cloud. Data encryption in the cloud means the data encryption is perhaps the most important control for protecting data. In the cloud environment as well the cloud service provider have several options for encrypting data and managing the encryption key lifecycle. Let's understand the various aspects of data encryptions in the cloud. Now, shared responsibilities for encryption based of, on the type of cloud services. What is meant by the various as aspect? It is important to understand that cloud services are majorly of three types that is IAS, PAS and SAS. IAS means infrastructure as a service, PAS means platform as a service and SAS means software as a service. You have already learned about them in the previous sections. But on type of various infrastructure references, the data encryption responsibilities and key management various. Let's understand the first one is the encryption responsibilities for infrastructure as a service. In this encryption responsibilities for infrastructure as a service, the first section is customer's responsibilities. Which are the customer responsibilities? First one is the customer data. After that, platform, platform applications, identity and access management. The third one is operating system, network and firewall configurations. And the fourth one is, there are the various aspects, client side data encryptions, data integrity and authentications, server side uh, encryptor, then the network traffic protection. In provider responsibilities, that is computer, storage and network. These services are provided by the providers, uh, those who is serve, uh, provide the service by the cloud provider. Now, for AIS, the customer has the entire responsibility for configuring data encryptions. The cloud service provider may provide the features and mechanism to help the customer configuration, encryptions and manage the key. But it is completely on the customer to secure data using those encryption mechanism cloud service provider has more or less and no control over the data encryptions for IAS infrastructure as a service an example of AIS a IAS service is virtual machines the customer must secure the virtual machines digs by the in encrypting it and the second one is encryption responsibilities for platform as a service. Uh, in this platform as a service, what is what are the customer responsibilities? At the first, customer data, then client side, data encryptions, data integrity and authentications, server side encryptions, network traffic protections, then the platform, applications, identity and access management operating system, network and firewall configurations, compute, storage and network. All these are the cloud service provider infrastructure. Means customer, what are the customer responsibilities? The customer data, client side uh, encryptions, data integrity and authentications, service side encryptions and network type protection. As we seen in the IA, IAAS, uh, in that we uh, customers responsible for number of components which is uh, seen in the previous uh, slide and in the past customers uh, responsibilities are very less but the provider responsibilities are platform applications identity and access management operating system network and firewall configurations compute storage network and these are the responsibilities by provider for pa AS, the cloud service provider shares more responsibilities than IAS. It takes 
it takes care of the operating system where the pass services is hosted as well as any pass services specific security configurations that you choose to configure an example of pass services pass service cloud be database service the cloud service provider can ensure that the disk on which the database record are stored is entirely encrypted you as a user do not have control over the os of the pass service however you can configure pass service specific security configuration for example you can provide the key that could be used for encrypting the database record in the third encryption responsibility for software as a service that is yes aas in that aas what are the customer responsibilities customer data after that client side encryptions data integrity and authentications these are the responsibilities of customer and what are the responsibilities responsibility of the providers that uh, service side encryptions network traffic protections platform applications identity and access management operating system network and firewall configurations computer storage and network for saas the cloud service provider takes the maximum responsibility it ensure that the service is entirely secured the disk the os the service configuration network topic etc are completely taken taken care by the service provider you could just choose to use the control provider provided and can encrypt the data an example of such service could be storage service you could just use it and provide the configuration infrastructure on how to encrypt your data and it take care of managing the keys and automating encryptions and decryption process as you read from our uh, from or write to the storage services in the second part the mechanism encrypting data in the cloud which type of mechanism the first is the service side encryption in the service side encryption the uh, we can see in the diagram the server in this type of encryptions the data is encrypted by the server before using return to the disk the client send the data in encrypted form and the server applies encryption to it when the client uh, client wants to read the data the server decrypt the data and send it securely over to the client the encryption and decryption process are completely transparent to the client this is provided by the server side encryption now what is the client side encryption in client side uh, client side encryption in this type of encryption the client encrypt the data before sending it to the server the server just write the data as received from the client and when reading the data the server passes the encrypted data back to the client the client must decrypt it before it can be read in the plain text this is the client service encryption thank you